Hi, my name is Twyla Abrams and I'm the founder and president of Pottery Avenue. Pottery Avenue was founded in 2004. The inspiration was actually set in 1989. Back in 1989, I took a trip to Poland. It was the end of the Cold War and the Berlin Wall was coming down and I just wanted to be there. I mean, it was almost like the minute the plane landed, you could feel the darkness of what the culture had gone through with the people and the humanity. I remember traveling from Berlin into Poland and going through a tiny little village and watching the Russian panzer tanks moving out. It was so scary. It was the middle of the night. It was a you know little brick cobble street. It was shortly after that is when I stumbled on the Polish stoneware. And so for a minute, uh, like a nanosecond in that trip, I actually could breathe. This little tiny vase, it captured my attention. Blue with little white polka dots. I had no idea why I was so intrigued with it, but it captured my attention. I realized it was the art. It was what survives when a culture is hit with such oppression, that the art can still remain and that people, we, as human beings, were intended to create. And that meant a lot to me, and I wanted to bring that experience to as many other people in the United States that wanted to connect with that. To me, at first, it was just a visual pleasure, and I liked it. Uh, something was very special about it. It's the color, it's the fact that somebody made it. It's the fact that um, this artist's work of art is sitting in my kitchen, and not only is it just a pretty thing in my kitchen, but it's actually something that I can use. It's an old school tradition, and so many of them have gone to the wayside. We want to make sure that, you know, taking leadership from the factory, we want to take their lead and go, you know what, it's the guy digging the clay, it's the craftswoman who makes the mold, it's the, um, you know, the young lady or young man who takes it out of the mold and cleans it and puts the handles on. It's the whole conglomerate, it's the whole effort of all of those hands that make the one piece. We have literally imported and distributed millions of pieces of dishware, so it's mind-boggling to me and when we're on Instagram or Facebook and I see somebody's posted a picture and I know that it's one of the pieces I brought in. It's absolutely amazing. It's almost like I'm sitting at that Thanksgiving Day table with those folks and they're talking about the dishes and just to know that I had a little sparkle <laughs> in there is the wind that keeps me sailing.